today we're gonna to be doing Angels Landing in Zion National Park. The hike is about 4.3 miles and is also considered one of the most dangerous hikes here in the United States of America. We were very fortunate enough to score permits for the next day. Originally when I was applying for permits for this hike um, in the advanced lottery we did not get it but yeah you do need a permit for this hike. Uh, so they offer three options. Uh, first option as far as time is you could start before 9 a.m. Uh, second option you could do 9 to 12 p.m. 9 a.m. to 12 p.m. And third option, anytime after 12 p.m. We scored um, the one for any time before 9 a.m. In our case, we have to take the shuttle, so um, we're gonna go park at the visitor center, and the shuttle start running in Zion at uh, 7 a.m. Um, at this time of the year. So we'll probably get there and maybe like 7.30 and start the hike at that time. We started the hike, it was 7.30 a.m. and about 30 degrees Fahrenheit, but the cold wasn't a factor because the hike is straight up elevation gain. There was a series of switchbacks in the beginning and it was daunting looking up at Angel's Landing knowing we had a long way to go. The next section in the hike is Refrigerator Canyon. It's called Refrigerator Canyon because it's much more cooler inside this canyon. It's also a quiet zone because Mexican spotted owls live inside this canyon. This section of the hike is easy until you get to Walter's Wiggle which is another series of 21 switchbacks. We made it to the chains. A permit is required beyond this point and a ranger is present to check those permits. If you have someone in your group who is afraid of heights or doesn't have a permit, they can wait at Scouts Lookout. It's crucial to be very careful during the section. It can get narrow in some spots and there is a huge drop. Here is the beginning of the chains and here is the very steep fall. We made it to the summit of Angel's Landing. The views of Zion Canyon is amazing up here. We spent an hour taking in the views and watching as the sun was lighting up the canyon walls. It was time to go back down and trust me I did not want to leave. As we were going back down I noticed there was way more traffic and a lot of hikers had scouts look out. Communicating with other hikers on the chain is vital. Anyways that concludes the video. I hope you enjoyed it.
please remember to like and to subscribe to my channel. I would really appreciate it.